uh, dear professors and uh, audience from the uh, uh, the whole world, it's my pleasure to be here to introduce my research on the translator study of the uh, TCM against uh, COVID-19 uh, by the way of the uh, uh, combination of the Chinese and Western medicine. I come from the Guangzhou Medical University, State Key Laboratory of uh, Respiratory Medicine, um, under the, the direction of the Professor Zhong Nanshan. So basically, we, as we know, um, the combination of Chinese and Western medicine uh, is very critical to uh, be helpful for our uh, strategy against the uh, new emerging respiratory viruses. So um, from this timeline, we can find that uh, since the 1954, uh, from the missiles and the SARS uh, uh, pandemic, H1N1 and, and COVID-19, the TCM plus the Western medicine play a, a major, major role. So I think it's very critical to understand how the Chinese medicine um, combined with the Western medicine uh, in the, the histologic and the uh, microscopic uh, angle to identify more uh, scientific uh, fighting and help the, anti, uh, the antiviral treatment is very, very critical. So here I would like to uh, uh, introduce a little bit about our critical uh, scientific question. As we know, the, when the virus came to our respiratory tract, uh, uh, before we always uh, focus on the pathogen. However, uh, uh, with the growing of the knowledge on the host uh, reaction uh, in immunologically, so we can find a, a cytokine storm also is very, very important. So, however, in this in this in this in this case, we can find the chemical compound is quite limited, and the, and the efficacy and, uh, and even some uh, safety is also not very ideal. So, because we know it's uh, very closely related to the pathogen um, um, uh, come back with the host uh, uh, immunity. So. Um, actually, uh, thousands of years ago, uh, in our Chinese medicine, uh, uh, very in, uh, classic books, we can find the evil means the actually means the, the very bad uh, things, uh, including the virus and the uh, 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 negative host reaction. It's very important. So the evil it means the uh, uh, from the external and also the internal. So how we can um, explain this by using the um, uh, very important uh, Chinese uh, uh, medicine. Uh, so what is the mechanism and what's the, uh, the major target? It's very uh, interesting yeah, and also very, very important uh, for the uh, clinical uh, uh, application. So um, yeah, uh, in my, in my uh, work, uh, since the pandemic H1N1, uh, to the H79, even the H5 and 6 human infections. Uh, and by using the clinical observation, observational and the cohort study, we realize that uh, the, the importance of the virus and the pathogen interaction. So it also means that uh, in Chinese medicine, it means the, the in external and internal evil um, uh, work together to uh, uh, damage our health. So based on these findings, clinical findings, uh, we also established a very uh, comprehensive uh, antiviral system, including uh, directly uh, anti-pathogen and uh, indirectly uh, and enhancing the immunity. It's very important. We also established the, uh, many models, uh, including the mice, ferrets, in over the primates. So because you know, uh, we want to make more uh, closely uh, relative uh, uh, animal model to the human. So number three, step three is very also important. We also uh, make use of the, the very classic Chinese medicine to uh, uh, um, prove our, our theory, I mean the uh, uh, treatment of the external and internal evil. So uh, in this way, we also are uh, very open to uh, apply the in vitro and ex vivo any models, and also the target models, as well as the immunology studies. 
So um, because of this uh, uh, the, uh, uh, the, uh, uh, work uh, in the ones, so uh, during this uh, COVID-19 outbreak, we uh, try to uh, research the Chinese medicine uh, against the uh, COVID-19 in, uh, in uh, experimental uh, study and uh, clinical study. So um, in order to uh, explain my idea, so here I would like to introduce uh, some several uh, examples. Uh, for uh, firstly, we can I can say what the meaning of the external evil. Actually, actually, it's a new emerging and also the uh, variant virus. Uh, so you can find from the H1N1, H7N9, we always find when some uh, a critical gene uh, mutation usually cause the very, very severe uh, uh, human infection and uh, uh, pathogenesis. How, what's the meaning of the in, uh, internal uh, evils? So from the host reaction, we also identify some. Uh, for example, the over uh, information reaction, like such as like uh, cytokine storms. So because you know, uh, in the normal health situation, usually we have very mild or moderated information. However, when the virus came, uh, 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 the fight uh, um, attack, usually the host will have the more overreaction of the information. Uh, the number the seven, uh, the second uh, evil, I think is very uh, quite 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 novel. It's the virus induced the uh, um, uh, cloning uh, bacterial uh, uh, infection. It also should be uh, uh, deemed as the the internal evil. So uh, during the X79 and X56 uh, outbreak, we always found the the very, very important mutation uh, induced this. Uh, 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 more severe uh, pathogenesis. So uh, this are also published in the EID. So and also display the the some uh, meaning. Uh, I mean the in meaning of the uh, um, circulating virus in Chinese term. Uh, number two is the, the there are two patients here, uh, patient three and patient four. Uh, patient four is a patient uh, show the uh, cytokine storm decreased gradually. Uh, but in the patient field, we can find uh, sev several outbreaks, uh, especially the, some rebound of the cytokine. And what was happening at that time, the, the patient was infected with the uh, Bomani uh, bacteria as well as the HSV virus. So it also showed that the Chinese medicine uh, the uh, thinking. Uh, this is because the influenza attacked the human and in all, uh, so that's making the uh, the internal evil. Um, another one is the during the H1N1, we also find the uh, when the uh, uh, H1N1 infected, uh, the usually the colonic uh, bacterial seem to be more active, especially the the motivation uh, gene express more. So it means may might be because the virus and the the bacterial. Uh, can e more easily uh, uh, assess the uh, lower respiratory and making the co-infection or secondary infection. And this finding also was uh, also consistent with the uh, the uh, the gene uh, related to the uh, infection uh, in x 7 9 patients. And also the same. So both of the uh, H1N1 and x 7 9 also show the uh, virus and the host uh, internal bacterial work together to make the uh, severity. So this is also, also the, uh, very consistent with the Chinese medicine theory. And finally, we also here we can find the uh, uh, COVID-19 severe cases. Uh, we observed some cases, uh, uh, the duration I mean, of the hospitalization even, even reach, I mean, uh, more than 60 days. We uh, collected the samples every two days uh, throughout uh, in the uh, of the uh, uh, the fruit uh, human body food, we can find again the uh, severe cases also uh, show the uh, uh, SARS-CoV-2 co-infected with the Bomani, even uh, the CMV, HSV, uh, such as the viruses. So this also again uh, emphasize the when the uh, the confu confusion of the lung uh, micro 
make the uh, uh, much more severity. severity. So this also uh, means the Chinese medicine uh, say uh, the external and internal evil uh, work together. So also the mucus is a very interesting finding. Uh, we can find this time in some cases we find the, uh, a lot of mucus uh, excretion, uh, much much more than uh, uh, others uh, pathogen seen before. So whether also the, the much uh, over secretion of the mucus also is the one of the uh, internal uh, evil. I think it's also very worthy to be uh, deeply studied and or investigated in future. Uh, uh, as to the uh, second uh, uh, example, because we are, this is the because we already have some uh, clinical findings. So how we can um, um, uh, replicate that this uh, uh, start uh, this this uh, process uh, in the, our animal model is very important. You know, mice is a very common uh, animal model. However, it cannot mimic the whole uh, uh, process of the natural infection. So it's quite quite not ideal for study the Chinese medicine, or so that's why we choose the ferret, even the chishu, uh, which is also a very classic the Chinese uh, the animal model. It's it's also a uh, one kind of the primate. It's all uh, very very uh, you know um, anti genetically close to the to the, uh, the the primates. So because this, so you can find we our Chinese. Me- uh, medicine uh, uh, scientist is very open. Uh, they uh, this animal model also uh, was uh, uh, funded by the grant of Chinese medicine. So uh, we found interestingly, we found that the tissue was easily infected with the clinical isolate of the H one N one, H nine two, even the flu B, and also it showed a very severe uh, respiratory symptom. Uh, uh, and also the nasal screening, uh, so very interesting. Of course, uh, we also fa- uh, observe the uh, anti uh, the viral replication as well as the uh, uh, lung uh, da- lung damage. So also, uh, what's the sensitivity to the uh, what's the what's the reason of the sensitivity to the to the uh, virus or to I mean to the external evil? We can find actually actually interestingly. The the uh, alpha two two v and alpha two six receptor distribution of, of the tissue is quite similar to those of uh, those of, uh, seen in human, and uh, much more ideal than the uh, mice. So it's also uh, one of the example of the how to do the Chinese uh, combined Western medicine. So this work was a very uh, honor to to be. Uh, uh, evaluated uh, uh, positively by the uh, Japanese and uh, U.S. and Chinese uh, scientists. So, because uh, we uh, have the uh, uh, investigated the uh, antiviral system, antiviral system for more than ten years, so we apply the more than seventy-five uh, very classic uh, TCM uh, in this. So we, on one hand, we uh, um, uh, identify more uh, good t- t- uh, uh, TCM against the influenza. Uh, another hand, we also uh, uh, find a, a very uh, uh, smart way uh, to to identify more uh, potential antiviral agents. So uh, number three uh, example is about Banlangen. So we identify five major uh, components. From this uh, uh, term, um, it's very interesting uh, and very uh, impressively the different uh, components pros of different role uh, du- uh, during the uh, replication uh, uh, cycle of the uh, virus uh, life, viral life. So, uh, for example, one some can help to uh, uh, bind the uh, HA protein of the virus. Uh, some can uh, help to in- inhibit. The interferon pathway. So anyway, um, in place the different multi uh, uh, roles in multi targets and taken together to to help to treat the influenza disease, not only influenza viruses. 
So um, from this, we also published more than 20 publications, including SCI uh, sourced publications. Also, we um, apply the innovation patent, including two PCD patents. So uh, these are the two set example. One is the Nikon uh, shows the antivirals and also uh, show the the activity of the uh, inhibit the trim to identify and rig eye and finally inhibit the uh, overreaction of the F kappa B and and the following cytokines uh, production. And also this is another one uh, components. I don't want to talk too much. It's quite similar. So because of this finding, we publish uh, one perspective review in science uh, supplementary uh, in 2015. So um, basically there are three very uh, critical points. One is uh, for uh, more understanding of the ch Chinese traditional medicine against uh, influenza. So first we should uh, always do the uh, clinical and basic research in parallel. Number two, we have to uh, understand uh, use, uh, in, in most cases the, the TCM play the uh, uh, major role of the multi-target with the uh, multi uh, components and also we need more uh, multidisciplinary uh, uh, technology work and tech experts work together to explore the, the new uh, pharmaceutical system this is very very important so in this time uh, we also apply this uh, theory uh, and the strategy to uh, identify uh, lo uh, 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 lots of the TCM against uh, uh, SARS-CoV-2. So, and this time very interesting because you know the Chinese medicine and Western medicine uh, doctors work together and and they they have the common uh, idea together. So the the disease can be divided into four phases, including the mild, moderate, se uh, severe, and critical. And also we can find some the similar uh, 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 stage of in TCM theory. So. This is our PFI lab. This is a picture of a PFI lab. We, uh, so far, we're still working on this. Uh, it has been uh, passing uh, uh, more than uh, 11 months this year. So we screened more than uh, nearly uh, more than 800 uh, uh, TCM uh, components, even the compounds. So we were very lucky to find them nearly 100 uh, agents against the virus or. Uh, inhibit the uh, cytokine uh, overreaction. So, so, so it's very, very lucky. So here I would like to say uh, Lianhua Qingwen is a very uh, critical uh, and classic example. Actually, before this uh, 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 outbreak, we already uh, um, uh, assessed uh, its antiviral and the influenza RSV, even worse coronavirus in uh, 2015. And also, we can also find that they can inhibit the uh, cytokine storm, it, uh, cytokine overreaction induced by these viruses. So, because we already know a lot, so this time we very quickly during the uh, January of this this year, we find the Hua Qingwen uh, capsule can inhibit the viral replication. Uh, not only in this uh, plaque assay, but also in the EM, we we find the viral virulent. Um, uh, obviously uh, decreased because of the Lianhua Qingwen capsule. Also, we also find it can inhibit uh, the cytokine uh, uh, induced by the SARS-CoV-2. So in the meantime, we also do the uh, multi-center uh, randomized clinical trial. Uh, in this trial, we uh, enroll the patient with the mild or moderate symptoms. So finally, we find that it can shut, uh, shorten the, uh, the duration of the symptoms and also enhance the recovery rate. It's very, very exciting. Uh, so this work was uh, very uh, soon uh, published in the Phyto Medicine. Um, because of this the basic and clinical study, so this time I think this the Lianhua Qingwen, uh, the instruction uh, was uh, added about the, the new uh, disease, uh, in, uh, not only in France, but also this time the uh, COVID-19. And also it was uh, uh, checked a lot of it, uh, uh, attention uh, in uh, online or even uh, domestic and global. So finally, I would like to say a little bit about the, what's the uh, the uh, potential or promising component 
I think uh, this is one uh, paper saying that routine uh, uh, forest forest row and hyper hyper row the docking score it, it is surprisingly uh, higher than the lopinavia. So you can imagine it. So we no, so uh, finally we focus on the the uh, chop. It's a, it's a major component of this uh, capsule. So you know uh, the the forest forest row and uh, one of the the single compound are. Uh, uh, the concentration is more than 0 0.2, uh, 0.15 percent is very, very important. So okay, so we apply this system to uh, again uh, to uh, evaluate its antiviral uh, efficacy uh, in vitro, and also we can find the potent, uh, pro uh, probable, uh, po possible, possible target of the COVID-19 is the VCL and PLP protein, and also it shows the inhibitory effects of the. Uh, cytokine as well as the NF kappa B pathway uh, up, uh, uh, up, 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 up rising. So, and so here we can say uh, the TCM not only the you know the the crew extra but also uh, some uh, compound also show the similar um, uh, 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 action manner of the antivirals. So also you know we, in China some. Uh, very important uh, 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 TCM in this ex uh, with the experience also showed the anti uh, coronavirus. For example, this work uh, led by the professor Huang Luqi also showed it, sh uh, it can inhibit the alpha and beta coronavirus family. So maybe in the coming future, it, sh it can help uh, to uh, us to understand its so, uh, uh, reason of the clinical efficacy. So finally, I would like to say some injection. Yeah, because uh, even in during the uh, uh, early stage of the critical uh, stage, uh, TCM also show the positive uh, role. Uh, we find uh, such a uh, CRP gene. Uh, uh, it also XBJ show the antiviral uh, efficacy as well as the anti-cytokine storm. And very, very more impressively, even to the uh, chief editor, we observed uh, uh, its efficacy uh, in uh, 13 uh, patients. We show the clinical symptoms and some uh, uh, critical ICU parameters, as well as the uh, information parameters shows a very good uh, finding. So that's why this paper also will publish uh, soon in the pharmacology research. Or uh, also uh, because of the TCM show the efficacy, we can uh, also uh, uh, make use of it. We use them to find more potential uh, antiviral target or pathway. So I think this also a new, uh, uh, also a surprising uh, uh, contribution to the anti uh, SARS-CoV-2 uh, uh, work. So finally, I think. Um, Combination of the Chinese uh, investment medicine, combination of the understanding of the uh, in external internal evil, I think this new theory uh, also uh, come from a very, very Asian stage. So uh, I think this still need to be more uh, deeply uh, investigated. Uh, not only the treatment, I think the prophylaxis is also very important uh, future uh, direction, because you know in this uh, COVID nineteen. At outbreak in China, I think TCM play a very major role in the control, uh, in the controlling the spreading of the the mild or or uh, mild or asthmatic uh, infections. So I think this is also another very interesting advantage and f uh, future direction. So we also published this idea in a Chinese uh, uh, magazine. So so. And um, finally, I would like to say in China, uh, not only the TCM research uh, organization, but also like us, uh, we also uh, is a very important uh, national research center. So we also uh, very um, emphasize the combination of the clinical and basic research, TCM and Western uh, combination of this to work together to to help to 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 help the anti. Uh, Pandemic. So this is finally some of our, our uh, research achievement, including 
we have uh, uh, some very important SCI publications, and also we have some very in important award from the nation, nation and the province, and some and so, and so, and so on. And more importantly, so in the future, we would like to illustrate uh, what's the in deep meanings of the external and external evil and the new tar uh, mechanism and new target of the antiviral TCM. I think it's, it will be very, very helpful and important for future study on the new emerging viruses. Thank you very much. This is our team, and this is our college working, still working in the PIF lab, and also our leader, leaders, uh, particularly Professor Zhong Nansang. Thank you very much.